It was pretty messy. There were a lot of like fallen trees and flooding. It was crazy. Um, I've never seen anything like that before. Historic rainfall had cars and kayaks traveling on water filled roads earlier this week. Well, Sacramento's flood risk is uh, one of the highest in the nation. On top of that risk, thanks to the city's low elevation on a floodplain largely surrounded by levees, the utilities department says the storm drainage system is old. Sacramento storm drain is up to 100 years old uh, in many sections, including uh, levees, pipes and pumps. Um, and they are deteriorating. So a proposal could go to Sacramento City Council later this year and then be up for a vote for property owners to decide on paying increased stormwater fees, about $70 more a year for the average single family homeowner. That money would help prevent pollution in rivers and creeks, repair old pipes and pumps, and prevent sewage from flooding neighborhood streets and parts of the city with a combined sewer system like East Sacramento, Land Park, Downtown, and Midtown. While many agree the system could use an upgrade. I'm all in favor for improving the infrastructure. I think it's been way too long. I think it should have been done a while ago. I think it's a long overdue. There are mixed feelings about the price for property owners. It is more expensive. I mean, that's that's something with given the gas prices and things like that and the cost of living going up. I mean, that's a, that's a lot of money. I can do a lot with that. And I know we don't want to put take more money out of our pockets, but you know, if we don't do this, uh, our properties are going to get damaged. Uh, there will be other costs that we're going to have to suffer. So either way, we have to pay. If City Council approves putting the fee hike on the ballot later this year, the question would then go to property owners. And if they vote yes, the increase could start in July. Live in Sacramento, Liz Amitri, KCRA 3 News. So a lot of people might be watching this uh, with us tonight. This is the first time they've heard about it. So what's the likelihood of a fee increase passing? The city said they did do a survey earlier this year that showed most people would support this idea and they have another one going out right now to again try to better gauge how voters will feel about this. All right, we'll see what happens next in this. Thanks, Liz.